Hey guys, welcome back to another YouTube tutorial provided by Blue Swift Axles. My name is Carson Holt and today we're going to be talking about tire wear and what causes it. Let's go ahead and get into it. The first scenario we're going to be looking at is called edge wear. Now edge wear happens when your tire is underflated uh, causing the center to drop in and both of the edges of the tire to wear. To fix this Reinflate your tire to the correct PSI or if it's too far gone, you will have to replace the tire. Another type of wear that is actually not that uncommon is sidewall wear. Now, as you can see on this tire, the regular tread looks fine, but the axle was bent causing it to toe in like this and actually rub the tire against the fender, causing it to wear out the entire sidewall, ruining the tire. The third type of tire wear is inside tire wear. Now this happens when a trailer axle uh, loses its camber and goes flat, causing the tires to wear on the inside while the trailer is rolling, or it can happen when the trailer is overloaded, causing that camber to once again go flat, bending the tires out like this causing that inside tire wear. On this one you can see the tire had to be replaced because it was worn completely smooth. Another type of tire wear is toe wear, where opposite from the inside of the tire, it happens on the outside of the tire. This happens when one or two of the tires on an axle are tracking either left or right instead of going straight, and this causes it to wear out the outside edge of the tire. As you can see, this one was worn all the way down to the cords and had to be replaced. The fifth and final type of tire wear is called cupping. Cupping happens when the tread is uneven all the way across the tire, all around the tire. Now, what causes cupping is when a tire is out of alignment, causing it to go up and down, side to side, um, just over time, causing that uneven ride on uneven surface causing that rough tire wear and ends up with a really bad ride uh, wearing the tire incorrectly thus causing the lifespan to decrease dramatically and causing you to have to replace that tire. Thanks for watching today's tutorial provided by Blue Swift Axles on tire wear, the types that there are and how it's caused. If you enjoyed today's tutorial please like and subscribe so you can see more like this. We'll see you in the next one.